in Texas, if you like it and I love my truck, lock it. <laughs> A Texas country music legend joining the campaign to stop car theft and theft from your cars and trucks. Welcome back to uh, singer and songwriter Gary P. Nunn and his friend from the Dallas Police Department, Sergeant Brian Roden. Gary, you grew up in a couple of small towns yes. where you probably didn't even lock the, the, the door on your house, let alone on your truck. That's, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you for being part of this campaign. How were you approached for this? Well, I, was, I got a call from the uh, Motor Vehicle vehicle crime prevention authority mm -hmm. and they asked me if i'd be interested in being a spokesman for this program where we are trying to raise the awareness around the state of uh of this uh, car theft uh, uh, problem that we yeah. have and, and how big of a problem is this sergeant uh, that's a pretty big problem uh, we're on a pace to hit about ten thousand offenses in the city of dallas this year the city so, of dallas alone now are you talking theft of cars or theft from cars and trucks i'm talking about vehicles being stolen J you, you walk out in the parking lot at the grocery store and your car or your truck is just gone or your driveway of your own home in many cases yes sir a and gary you undoubtedly have gotten a little education on this in a lot of cases it's because people have not locked they car not taken their keys and locked their car. Like yeah. So many times, you know, I'm driving, I'm traveling all over, I'll pull in to get a cup of coffee at a convenience store. There'll be two or three cars idling with nobody sitting in them. There, there's right. just an invitation to be stolen. You, you want to, Now that you're part of this campaign, you probably want to go out and tap them on the shoulder and say, don't do that. I know. <laughs> I really would. Um, you, thefts up 18% this year. In, in the city of Dallas, is that is that about right? I mean, that that's just a, a shocking number, and, and an easily preventable crime. Yes, uh, four out of ten vehicles in the city are being taken by by key key related offenses. People just not being you know just careless with yeah. their keys and uh, uh, you know not being really uh, um, keeping aware of them. Yeah, um, and, and a lot of cases, yeah, people leave them out in the driveway. Uh, sometimes the VIN numbers are faked and swapped out. What what is? I think you might have been driving one of the most often stolen vehicles in uh, in Texas. Yeah, the uh, right now in, in the city of Dallas, the number one stolen vehicle is a 2018 GMC uh, newer model pickup. Uh, and uh, when you lose those, people start changing the identification numbers on them and try to resell them. And it's just a really bad uh, situation for all parties involved. Do you sometimes find people who have bought a stolen car or truck and don't know it? Yes, it's very heartbreaking to be able to take that vehicle from them, a truck that they paid five, ten thousand dollars $10,000 in cash for online or some other, you know, uh, you know, uh, offer up program or something like that. And then when we find out stolen, they already spent the money. Yeah. You know, it's heartbreaking. And, and Gary, a lot of times people have things, ta if, the, if the car or truck is not taken, something is taken from it. Um, I hear from police a lot of times, a shocking number of times, somebody will say, my gun got taken. Well, was it locked? Was the car locked? No, it wasn't. And a gun is now on the streets. Right. And even, you know, this smash and grab thing, I've been the victim of that a couple of times. In the, and lost some valuable materials, uh, writings and, uh, and money and cash. Uh, just uh, in, uh, you turn you back for five seconds and uh, it's gone. Yep, so. all right. So once again, uh, if, if, uh, if you love it, lock it. If you suspect a car is stolen or possible uh, chop shops going on in Dallas, you can call Dallas Police at 911 or 214-670. 5900 obviously wherever you live just call 911 we have a link with more information to this campaign on fox4news.com thank you both thank you, thank you.